gonna be off center. I'm gonna stay away from this concrete edge some. So it's gonna be off center somewhat. And I'm gonna dry drill into this uh, patch piece that's been added. It's just going the right way. This is really soft concrete. All right, that looks deep enough. I've never done this before. I think I need a bit of a crowbar. That uh, looks pretty good. And that's what you're not supposed to do. Now I know. I'm going to put the side poles. I'm going to put it right up in here. Through the and anchor from the top. Wish me luck. The eye bolt in with the washer just to keep that from tearing up that. I'm going to put a rubber grommet. Another washer. And then I'm going to put the nuts on it. This is what it looks like from the top side. I got it anchored up at the top, next to my pole here, and anchored right down there in the, in the ground. Just got it snugged up a little bit. Got one of these beefy dog stakes. I'm going to use it to help anchor the, the awning. Uh-oh, hitting something. I don't want it to be a pipe. Let's try over here a little bit. This feeds right through the ratchet. Pull the slack out. All right. And again, there's a lot of strength, even with that couple inches of leverage. You don't want to overdo it. Just want to snug it up without bending it. For this awning, uh, right near each hole, I've got a extra strap holding it down. I anchored it like I showed you, and at the top, one. Two and three. So all three of these anchors to help hold that down. Obviously, if it gets really ugly, it ain't gonna work. But it'll help. Same thing. Got an anchor down there in the concrete. Twenty foot snap strap. Strap uh, ratchet strap over here to hold it down. This will help keep the roof on the awning and the laundry room. And then last but not least, we got the strap coming through. And no concrete on this side, but I do have a dumb dog sticks. One I picked up and one old one I had, so I'm just going to double. It won't take much to pull that out. It's just a little safety net. All right, I just finished picking up all the straps. Got them all. I just put them all in a tub. I'm going to put it on my shelf. Here's that long uh, snatch strap I used over the laundry room. I'm going to leave the stakes in the ground. And I'm just putting all these straps um, for the next storm. So, my roof undamaged. And maybe it would have survived without the straps. Don't know. It's there. Several neighbors up and down the street, though, around the neighborhood, lost their roofs. The winds peeled them back. So, that, that little extra. Don't know if it was wasted time or not. Wasted energy. But I do know my roof is there. These are in storage. The eye bolts are going to stay in the ground. I'll put some plants around them so I don't trip on them. I could probably unthread them, but I'll just protect them. But we're good. See you in the next video.